Interesting. So could you speak about life science in general or is MedDevice your, your No, no, I've, uh, I've uh, developed uh, innovations in pharmaceuticals, devices, diagnostics. Okay, so you have a marketing director that's at a life science company, whether it's pharma, MedDevice, biotech, and they're struggling to come up with a plan, a, go, a good go-to-market plan or a product marketing plan. Mm -hmm. If you came in to consult them as you have before, what, what do you do? What's what's the first step of looking at what the problem is? So this was the very first thing when I, when I first CEO the company it was my consulting group. And it was designed to, um, for, for big pharma companies where I'd launched products with huge resources, um, but, um, uh, but also um, uh, for young companies who were starting out. And because where we sit right now, Sereno Valley, is populated with a lot of the latter, these sure. small, young incubator companies uh, or groups that have uh, have taken uh, intellectual property out of the, the medical center at UCSD or Scripps here and have bought that IP to, to commercialize technology. Um, this is what I deal with a lot. And in fact, when you hire in a startup, you are selecting people like this. And it doesn't matter whether they are uh, on the commercial side, on the engineering side, on the operational side because there's something about startups that's not right for everybody. It has in it implicit risk, 